tracking weather with an hour-by-hour forecast. Channel 6 is the Weather Authority. Hi, everybody. Hopefully you're enjoying your Sunday. Cold conditions. A lot of us, at least some of us, saw some snow last night. Metro points east and south. Those of you who did see the snow, watch out for slick spots through the day today. Doesn't take much snow to cause some of those icy conditions on the roadway, so use a little bit of caution. Now we move forward past this storm and really turn our attention to the cold temperatures and windy conditions. That's a bad combination with the cold and wind. Negative wind chills, in fact, waking up tomorrow morning could be as cold as negative 20, so make sure to bundle up. And if you have outdoor pets, please check on them continuously. Their water is going to freeze and of course, they certainly need the heat as well. Through the day today, not a whole lot of relief here. Temperatures are in the teens. We'll call it a mix of sun and clouds. Stormcast here wants abundant sunshine. I don't know about that. I think we'll see at least some clouds out there. By 4 o'clock, these temperatures will hold into the teens. You factor in the winds, feeling more like the single digits. By 7 o'clock this evening, partly cloudy skies. Temperatures fall back, lower teens. Then by 10 o'clock, we start to fall back into the single digits. Waking up tomorrow morning near negative 2. But again, watch out for those winds. When you factor in the winds near negative 20. Not a whole lot of relief by Monday afternoon, 9 degrees. Then for Tuesday, Christmas Eve, we're looking at a few festive flurries, not expecting much more than that, but any light snow you get on Christmas Eve is always nice. Then Christmas itself, 35 degrees. If you're traveling to see family or friends, should be good to go.